Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have a review for you today of Candles by Victoria's Candles. And I haven't done a review in a long time, but when I got these candles in from this company, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to let people know about these candles and you have to go check them out. Um, if you're not familiar with Candles by Victoria, they are out of Texas. This lady makes these candles by hand, her and her staff do it. Um, these candles do not sit on a shelf waiting for you to order them. You place your order and then they make the candles and send them out to you. Unless you happen to live in Van, Texas, then you can go to the store. Um, and the scent, the scents are amazing. The variety of scents is bananas. There's like over 850 scents available from them. I mean, what other candle company? I, I would be shocked to hear of any other candle company that has over 850 cents available. <laughs> available like right now for you to order. So um, when I placed my order, this was a couple weeks ago, I ordered a bunch of these four ounce jelly jar candles and they're five bucks a piece. As far as I know, this is the smallest candle that they offer that has a wick. They do also offer like tart, like um, these, they're called scent shots to burn in your um, candle tart burners and stuff like that and they offer bigger candles, multiple wicks and just tons and tons of different things. If if I sat and talked about everything that they offered this video would be 30 minutes long so um, I'm gonna go over, I ordered nine of these um, small candles. Uh, like I said five bucks a piece and I think that that's actually a good price for this size candle and once you realize how good of a candle it is then you then five bucks is a really good deal for it so um, I also have another order coming from them that is more Christmas candles and I considered doing them all together like waiting for those to come in and then doing it all together but again the video would be so long that that we wouldn't be able to do it nobody would watch it it would be so long so okay um, got my candles in they were all wrapped up very nicely in bubble wrap so that nothing happens to them but I'm quite sure if anything ever did you just have to call them and they would um, help you out with that so first candle that I ever burned from candles by Victoria was the Kahlua Cafe Olay this candle smells so good here's my empty candle and I'm gonna do frowny face because this smelled so good so far this is my favorite scent um, I love the smell of coffee, but I don't like to drink it. So I picked out the Kahlua Cafe Au Lait because I know Kahlua is supposed to like taste like chocolate. So I thought chocolate and coffee would smell really good, and it really did. And um, when I started burning this candle, I could not believe the scent throw with these candles. I've never had a candle. Seriously, I'm not exaggerating. I've never had a candle that smelled, that scented as big of an area as this little four ounce candle did. Um, one of the last times that I was burning this candle, I sort of forgot that I had it lit and I went to fold a load of laundry in my bedroom. Well, I have to close my bedroom door when I do that because I have cats and it's just a pain in the butt. So I fold my laundry, I open my bedroom door and I can smell the candle all the way in the back of my hallway. And yes, I live in an apartment, but it's like over a thousand square feet. I mean, it's a decent size. And this little four ounce candle had made my had made almost my entire apartment smell delicious so I just couldn't believe that and I also ordered the regular cafe au lait from them um, this smells wonderful too I love again the smell of coffee is delicious this one isn't quite as complex as the cafe au lait but I think that it will smell delicious just in a different way so I'm excited to burn that one too so the second candle that I ever burned from candles by Victoria is Deep Mountain Maple. Now this candle smells smelled good in the jar but when I lit it honestly I didn't think that it had a very good scent throw on this one. I'm not sure why. Um, she does talk about a curing time with these candles and how they get better you know as they get a little bit older so I'm not sure if maybe this one needed another day or two to cure but it really didn't smell um, didn't have a good scent throw. But I did order two other candles along the same maple lines because I love that scent. I ordered Log Cabin and this candle smells really interesting. The first scent that I pick out of there is like a butter smell or like a sweet butter smell or something. 
And then you can smell the maple, of course, and vanilla. Um, I believe in the description for this candle, it says that it was created for a woman who wanted to fool her husband into thinking that she was making breakfast. So I'm really excited to burn this and see um, what the scent is that blossoms out of it. So, And then I also ordered a vanilla maple pecan. This one smells great, too. It's a little bit lighter and a little bit sweeter than the um, log cabin but it smells great so and many of the scents that I ordered were this brown color and at first I was kind of disappointed like oh why why are they all brown but then I thought well pancakes brownies coffee they're all brown things so <laughs> then I was like oh yeah okay that makes sense so now the third candle from CBV that I am currently burning is chocolate chip cookie and I actually had to put this candle out earlier so that it would solidify enough for me to make this video. This candle smells great. I don't actually get a lot of scent out of it. I don't get a lot of scent just um, smelling it out of the jar. I mean, I can smell it, but it's not like a huge scent. But when I burned it, it really did blossom out of the jar and it smelled really great. I'm not sure that it smells exactly like a chocolate chip cookie, um, but it smells good. And I definitely would recommend it, especially if you love chocolate chip cookies. So then um, the other two bakery scents that I have, uh, one is Cinnabon. Now they had two cinnamon roll scents. There was this one, and then there was another one called, I think, Cinnamon Buns. And I decided to go with the Cinnabon because I thought, well, that's a known thing, and every time you go to the mall and you can't pass it up and this and that. So I got this. I was really excited to get it, but how when I smell it, the only thing that I really smell out of there is cinnamon. The cinnamon is almost overpowering in the jar so I'm interested to light it and see if anything else comes out of it like a sweetness or a vanilla like the frosting scent or something um, but we'll see and then I also ordered the fudge brownie now when I first was perusing their website and making my mental wish list which now you don't have to do it mentally they have a wish list feature right on there and I have to say that is slick and especially when you're ordering it and you click the pull down menu and it says where would you know what category of scents do you want to choose your scent out of and then you say my wish list and all your scents are right there that you've already decided that you want to order it's really really slick so um, when I was making my mental wish list the fudge brownie was one of the first ones that I knew I wanted to try I used to work in a bakery and the best day in the bakery was when they well I've worked in many bakeries but <laughs> The best day in the bakery was when they were baking the brownies and the entire bakery would smell like fresh brownies and it was the best scent in the world and I have been on a quest ever since to find a candle that smells like brownies. And this one smells pretty close. <laughs> I think this one smells closer to an actual brownie than anyone I've ever smelled before. I've smelled a few other ones before. So I'll be really interested to burn that one and see how close to a brownie we actually get with that. So then the last one that I ordered, and this one wasn't a bakery scent, this one was called White Christmas, and it said on the website that this candle was very popular like last Christmas, so I thought, well, all those people must know what they're talking about. Um, it's not quite what I thought it was going to be. It's very... Um, intriguing scent. <laughs> uh, I'm not a huge fan of floral scents, but I, I almost can't even pick anything out of this candle to say exactly what it smells like. I do smell some green in there, like I don't know if it's Christmas tree or some other type of green. Definitely some of that. And then there's some fruitiness in there, I think. <laughs> It's, it's hard to say what it, exactly what it smells like, but I'll be interested to burn it and see, um, you know, what, what it smells like once you burn it. Because uh, so far the candles smell a lot different once you burn them, so I'm excited for that. And then the little scent shot that they so graciously sent me, um, I'm sure as a thank you for my order, but I thank them for thinking of me with this little thank you, uh, is called Montego Bay. And I love the color of this probably because it's the most colorful one that I got of my <laughs> candles um, and I have to say although this was a freebie and I'm I'm very appreciative of it it's not really my thing 
It's very um, floral. But there's also a fruitiness in there, isn't there? I t that's another one that's so com complex that I wish I had more describing words to describe these candles. So um, that was my order from Candles by Victoria. And I almost feel like describing what scents I got to you doesn't even really, because they have so many scents, like anything that you can possibly think of, they have a candle for. And if you can think of something that they don't have a candle for and you want to smell it, send her an email. They take suggestions. Um, they do take suggestions. So definitely check them out. I think that these are far superior candles to anything that I have tried so far. And within a couple minutes of lighting my first candle by them, I sort of decided, wow, I really don't ever want to, to waste my money on another candle company again. <laughs> I really just want to order candles by Victoria because they are so good. So um, thanks for watching this video and watch for my next haul from them because I have a lot of Christmas scents coming in. And hopefully I can come up with some better describing words than just... Wow, this smells so intriguing. I don't even know what it smells like. <laughs> that doesn't help you at all. So hopefully next time I will be able to do better than that. So thanks, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.